Hey guys, thanks for joining me again for Rise of the Tomb Raider. Uh, we're now on part 17. We're just on our way to figure out what's going on with Trinity. And yeah, we're just now in the forest, so we'll just continue through and see what's happening. Here is your lesson for today. Bring me any creature with feathers. The birds in our valley fly mostly by day, nesting away at dark. You've seen gulls and other kinds farther afield. Those common birds would count for today's lesson, but it would lack ambition. You clever students who wish to impress me would do well to head to the high elevations between dawn and dusk. I would find buzzard most impressive. And before you ask, the chickens around our village came here with our ancestors. Bringing me a tame bird from your mother's yard will not fulfill the assignment. Okay, what am I... The fuck? Oh, we have to go that way. Okay, let's just get into this building first. Kinda thought I was too close. I can no longer deny the pull that Alia has on me. She came to me, alone, as I walked the passes high above the valley. I know now that the draw was mutual. I explained to her why I could not, should not, why my position amongst our people should preclude such folly, why I could never make her happy. But it didn't matter what I said. As my mouth spoke, my arms reached out to enfold her, and we embraced. It has been so long, and I am still human. Can't take that. Another map. Okay, so we're heading that way. What is that? Fuck, this map is huge.
Wait, what the fuck? Okay, I could have sworn I saw fire over here. Oh, fuck. Almost shot you, guy. You're alive. Good. We got most of the wounded to safety. The invaders returned. They've taken the upper village. There are more of us down in the valley, organizing for our resistance. We'll take any extra hands we can get. If you're going back to the village, be careful. Okay, dude. Resistance from the natives. Not after this. We'll probably catch a few more stragglers slinking around the woods, but yeah. You take any alive? Turn them over. They're taking them back to the old prison. Just the ones they think might know something about the atlas. Constantine's gonna ask them a few questions. They've got the rest back up near the cathedral. Someone's gonna have some fun. That must be them. Fuck. Dude just fucking stands there like nothing's going on. It's like the moment I go to shoot is when they duck. Hey, what's going on with this rope? Go that way. I'm in trouble. Big fucking trouble. I've been snooping around, saving a few files for my personal use, and I found a correspondence thread about me. Worse, 
I think I was supposed to find it. The head of security knows I've been leaking data. Probably known all along, and they're just watching for now, waiting to see what my end game is. I wish I had an end game. I'm gonna die just because I was nosy and stupid. I don't even think this channel is secure now. They could have picked you up already. I'm getting paranoid out here. But this Trinity, they are big, and they're everywhere. And the more I find out, the more I realize how badly I fucked up. So here you go. You were right. Hope I get to tell you that in person. Everybody's just fucking walking in a line. That was weird. Which way are we going? Nothing in here. Going over there, okay. Now I see it. Just in there. Okay. Which way are we going? Wrong arrow. We heard of the Prophet's arrival in Constantinople, but we paid it no mind. The great city has always drawn madmen and pretenders to the ear of God. We heard strange tales of miracles of the Prophet, but still we did not seek him out. But then we heard him speak, heard the liquid truth of his words roll across the form of Constantine. 
He claimed not to speak for God, claimed that no man could. But his wisdom was plain, and not a one of us in that forum could deny that he spoke the truth. I must know more about him. I must hear... Okay. I guess that's all I could do in here. Okay, we gotta get up there somehow. Can't do that. say it's, it's not his call but he's gonna put a recommendation in for us both then there'll be an initiation ceremony of some sort so that's it that's all he can do look some of those guys were on contract for years before Trinity gave them rank you have to be patient there's more to it than performance like what there's some sort of oath and then the ceremony he said we'd find out soon enough hiding guy fuck and finally got you dick oh shit he's shooting at me Somebody see me? Light her up! Moving into cover! Grenade out! Guys in your fucking grenades. Thank you. 
Well, awesome. Was that all of them? Croft is operating against us at every turn. Someone put a fire in her. Lord Croft was too bookish to possess any true resolve. He was a coward. His daughter is something different. I almost gave an order today that no man should kill Croft but me. I fear she is starting to cloud my judgment. I must remind myself, the goal is not another dead Croft. The goal is the divine source. in here at least. Oops, bottles. Another one. body. Now it threatens my mind as well. I keep drifting off. Getting lost in memories. Lost in thoughts of the day Lord Croft died. How the plan had to shift. How I thought we had failed. And before that, my early days with Trinity. Learning the secret histories of the world. Learning that it was our duty to save it. And back farther to childhood. Constantine and I with only each other to rely on. And then I rip myself free back to the present. I've always done what had to be done. And this time will be no different. Okay, where are we going? Going up. Elias and I will attempt to reach the far hills, where the old bear lives. Trinity is still clustered below in the old Soviet base. We will wait until the dead of night to go. It is a great risk, but we know a battle is coming. We'll have need of the medicinal herbs that grow in those hills, if we are to survive the coming struggle. Okay, we have to go that way. See what we could upgrade. Okay, that that'll help receive less damage. Okay. Shit, man. Get up, fuck out of here. Fucking thing, man. Fucking mountain mine just scared the shit right out of you. Head 
What's up? We seem to have lost contact with the Fuck. team sweeping the lower valley. Do you have eyes on them? Negative. Possible hostiles? Could just be radio interference, but Constantine's not taking chances. <laughs> How did he not hear me shooting the fucking mountain lion? That was close. For a month I have gone to the forum to hear the prophet speak. I wear robes of the common folk. It would not do for a son of a great house to be seen here. There are rumblings that the patricians and men from the church in the west seek to silence the prophet. I can only listen and reproduce the great man's words. No man has ever told the truth about God, for no man can ever know. There is more sacred in the heart of a farmer or a soldier than in the hearts of lords and emperors. We are all of us deceived by those that claim to speak on behalf of the Creator. No man speaks for him, for his voice in the sky, the water, and the flow of the world. Okay. <gasps> It's actually a lucky throw to actually hit a ledge. Which way are we going? So this is really it, huh? They do find the atlas in there. What's next? The Atlas is a oh, shit. It's supposed to point the way to whatever the natives are protecting out here. The divine source that Constantine is after. That's a part I'm not clear on yet. Whatever his source is, it's gotta be something valuable. But the company men aren't safe. Okay, where'd that guy go? see anybody else yet. Okay, so we have to get into the cathedral. Well, that was easy.
These ruins hide much good. You cannot go too deep or too fast. The men are trying to be cautious. Cautious? Why? We no longer have time for caution, and I no longer have the patience for it. With all due respect, if all of my men die down there... We are all expendable here, Commander. What matters are results. The stakes are too high. Um... There we go. We've reached the lower level, but we have another problem. We've lost our rear guard. Define lost. No radio contact, no visual contact, just gone. Then proceed without them. That's outside mission protocol, ma'am. It introduces unnecessary risks. Can you achieve your goal without them? Ma'am, I don't think we're alone down here. I need tactical support. No, we're stretched too thin across this battle. If you feel you're being pursued, then I suggest you move faster. Unarmed woman? That would be cold even for you, Lara. Then again, I know why you haven't pulled that trigger. Shoot me, and my men will cut you down within seconds. It's the one thing they're better at than you. Shut up, Anna. Don't move! You have nowhere to go! Kill her! Now! Bring me that goddamned Atlas. 